meet the newest social media app. This is Beam. B-E-M-E. -E. Beam. Beam was created by this guy, Casey Neistat. He's a filmmaker and artist and YouTube star. Casey wants people to share what they're really like. Casey's goal for Beam is to be authentic. Beam equals authenticity. In Beam, there's no review or preview, so what you share and post is what's really going on around you. There's no filters and there's no editing. So it's a real-time uh, live feed of what's going on. Beam works by using the proximity sensor on your phone right next to the front-facing camera. So the main reason the app uses the proximity sensor on the phone is that it wants to broadcast what's going on around us without holding the phone up in front of our faces. So to do that, you would put the proximity sensor against a chin, your chest, or a hard surface in order for it to pick up what's going around. And likewise, we turn it uh, the other way and put it against a hard surface for it to pick up our selfies. So to post something on Beam, I just open up the app on my phone go to the home page, and if I want to post a selfie, I have to put the proximity sensor, which is on the front face of my phone, against a wall. Once you hear that noise, it's going to start recording, and it'll stop after four seconds. To view stories on Beam, you just hold down a person's username, and the story pops up. If you like a story, you can react by sending a selfie, and that's located in the top right-hand corner. Beam is still really new in terms of social media platforms, but it's really fun and a unique experience to hold up your phone up to your chin or chest. Um, I encourage you to try it out, even though it's just released this year, it has a few kinks they have to work out, but I, I encourage you to download it and it's available on the App Store.